running out of laptop battery in the middle of an important work or meeting always makes us run for the charger. But while you're not near a socket or traveling outside, you may need extra juice for your battery to run a little longer. Even if you can carry a battery backup in your laptop bag, if some simple settings can help you hold the operating life a little more, won't you try that out? In this video, we'll share some tricks and tricks that you can do to expand your battery life of your precious laptop. To save your battery charge, the first thing you should do is modify your battery settings. On Windows, you'll quickly get those settings on the right side of your taskbar. Then, click on the battery icon and you will get a slider access for battery power mode. But if you don't have the slider on your Windows yet, then go to Settings, click the system icon, search for Power and Battery and you will find the power mode there. Here you can choose the preferred mode for your laptop based on your workflow and running time. But to expand your battery life, it's best to use the power saver mode by default. It reduces the display brightness by 30%, stops Windows update downloads, blocks the mail app from syncing, and eliminates most background apps for times. And if you have a MacBook on hand, the settings will be done through the battery and power settings. Just open the system preferences app and click on battery. Here you'll get some options to check, which eventually affect your battery level and performance. So to increase the battery life on Mac, check on the slightly dim display while on battery power and uncheck the power nap option to stop your device from waking up now and then to check updates. Even depending on your version of MacBook and Mac OS, you'll also discover some additional options for energy saving. For example, the Optimize Video Streaming While on Battery option will disable HDR video playback and optimize battery charging. In addition to that, same as Windows, you'll also get energy mode settings on Mac to energize your battery performance. Closing unnecessary apps and battery draining settings is a common yet useful trick that everyone should use for the sake of the laptop batteries. Keeping hundreds of apps open at one time while not using them eats an immense amount of your battery, which you can use for some necessary work. Even keeping on the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth settings constantly also drains the battery life faster. Turning off the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth while not using the web or data transfer can also buy you some extra juice. Though you have turned off all unnecessary apps running in the taskbar, still some of the apps automatically keep accessing your laptop from the background. To identify those apps, you can search the processes that automatically run when Windows starts or go to the Task Manager app. Keeping the brightness level to the max is another significant drain on battery lifespan. The brighter screen sucks the battery faster than any other apps or settings. So, lowering the brightness level to visible is the wisest thing to do. Generally, you'll get two function keys for brightness control on the keypad. But if you don't, go for the display option on the settings or the brightness slider in the Windows Mobility Center of Control Panel. And for Mac, the settings are almost identical. Just go to System Preferences from the Apple menu, click Displays and adjust the brightness. We mostly keep laptops on our laps or any smooth surface like a table, bed sheets or pillows. But keeping laptops on a smooth surface blocks the airflow of the laptop and heats the interface causing severe short-term and long-term damage to the battery and other parts of your device. So, it's recommended to use a laptop airflow stand to prevent damage from airflow blockage. Most of us have a terrible habit of not plugging in the charger until the battery dies. It's an immense strain on battery when we work on a laptop having charge under 20%. So, putting on the charger as fast as it comes near 20% is best to expand your battery operation and capacity. Another big mistake we usually make is keeping the charger plugged in all the time. Constantly plugged in wires reduces the number of cycles the battery has. That's why, try to keep your battery cycle between 20% and 80% to have more battery cycles. To wrap things up, we can say there are various ways to maximize the operational life of your laptop battery. But from the recommended list, tweaking your battery settings and closing unnecessary big apps during work time is the most important one as these facts drain the battery charge faster. So. That was all about increasing your laptop's battery life. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and comment below to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.